one of the very confusing things about pressure is that in the real world we use two different types of pressures. One pressure is the absolute pressure. The other one is what we're calling a gauge pressure. And when we talk about this, it gets confusing because we're so used to gauge pressure. Almost all of the pressure gauges we have out there uh, read a gauge pressure. They're calibrated in a way, or they're set to read zero pressure when really the pressure is one atmosphere. So there's always this case of what's the absolute pressure uh, related to the gauge pressure. And it's a simple relationship, and it's kind of easy to understand. It just says that whatever your gauge pressure is, you add to it what the actual atmosphere condition is to get you your absolute pressure. These equations tend to work only for absolute pressure, but when we use a gauge to read it, we normally have to calibrate ourselves. So normal pressures are set to 760 millimeters of mercury, or one atmosphere. So we have to add in the 760 millimeters of mercury to get it. Just be careful and make sure you're using the correct one. So if you have a, ever have a question, the question should imply what is the one being used. If not, ask questions and make sure you are using the right, uh, right pressure. Otherwise, you might be off by a full atmosphere of pressure.